Hello beautiful people, good morning, another day, another vlog. It is super duper hot in the countryside, actually in the entire Philippines, I would have to say except Baguio, but wow, this is crazy. Today is actually the beginning of us extending Papa's bedroom in the front, so again, we are building the balcony or terrace so that he can have a place to hang out and chill while recovering from his illness papa is right here guys look he's just chilling <laughs> listening to his music but um he cannot really like walk around in this heat um, he's still taking his meds and all that actually on wednesday we're gonna be going to the doctor again to have blood tests for him to check his crea bun and all that i don't really know exactly but that's what we're gonna do and then on thursday we're gonna have a follow-up checkup with the nephrologist so for now this is what we're doing i have to have umbrella guys because it's very hot Ta-da! all right so we're gonna go to sis house they've actually started doing the extension so this is one mini dump truck of sand let's go right here and okay so we have here some of the materials that was being purchased already we have here a bar the roof is right there we have square tube over there we have here the hollow block so the hollow block they've actually um it was supposed to be over there where the sand is so i think they brought it here so it's easier for them to do the piling so this is what they've done so far it's currently 1 p.m right now they started at 8 a.m this morning so we have three people working on this and as you guys can see they've started doing the foundation that is how it looks so the foundation is this iron tube thing so the yeah the this is three the measurement of this is three and then that's how it looks in the bottom and then the other one is right there guys as you guys can see so this is 10 by 10 feet um if you guys can take a look they're now mixing here sand and cement and yeah so this is the current situation right here again it's always like this when you're like building something it really looks like it's very small like from here when i look at it it looks very small but once you've already finished it that will actually look big i mean it's gonna be spacious all right everybody we're gonna do grocery haul because i went to the city so we can have some food here at home okay most of these are actually for papa so we have here sky flakes because that's what he can eat we have here dried fish Tada! all right i have your maltesers my favorite chocolate and then we have here salt and then fit bar actually these are for me fit bar and then we have here oyster sauce we have here by the way five kilogram of rice and then we have here shamrock biscuit we have sugar bravo biscuits for snacks this is for scarlet 
ice candy. Have here Tupperware. We have here Pringles. <laughs> This is not for Baba, this one, okay? I have here Tim Tam, finally, oh my gosh. Scarlett will be so happy to see this. All right, we have here one liter of water because Papa uh, can only consume one liter of water per day. So I decided to get this bottle so that at least this is what he can drink for the entire day. And then we'll just have to refill it. These Mentos is actually for the car. We'll put that over there. And then I have here a bunch of, what do you call this, yogurt drink. That's for Scarlett and me and everyone else. Have here fresh milk, not fresh, but we call that fresh milk. Chucky for Scarlett. And then a bunch of yogurt, yogurt milk. Okay, so we have here milk for Papa as well. And then here some stuff for the room some dishwashing liquid so yeah dishwashing liquid i have their safeguard toothpaste this glade actually this one smells good i tried this one in the grocery let's oh smells good i like it and then in this box i have two boxes guys so this one, I have here paper towel, sliced bread, because Papa Papa's snacks is just plain bread. And then we have here cabbage. And then one of you guys actually recommended for me to try Japanese cucumbers. I got this one. My gosh, this is actually pricey. Look, 125 pesos for two pieces only. <laughs> and then I have here a bunch of apples for Papa's snacks. And then onion, garlic, I have here papaya and then I have here squash normally for like um, fish anything seafood and for the vegetables it's sis that will get it because we want it to get it fresh so she gets it in the wet market so these are just the ones I could get in the store all right we have here sukang pinakurat it's good and this is the heaviest one of them all I don't know how many kilos of meat is this, but these are mostly white meat, guys. It's all chicken, and I just have a few um, pork for us, but mostly it's chicken breast filet. I still don't know yet how, how are we gonna cook that um, for Papa, because obviously <laughs> we're still trying to adjust. Like every time um, Sis will cook, he will remove some of it first to give it to Papa before he puts salt or any, yeah.
Beautiful people, good morning. This is the next day. It is 38 degrees Celsius in the countryside right now. Papa is here taking some rest. He is watching a movie in his cell phone. He is looking a lot better. He actually showered today, guys. And we told him to not make sure not to like wash the area where the it's not called fish chula malagina, it's catheter kuno. IJ catheter. <laughs> okay, a lot of you guys have been saying MJ it's not fish chula. Okay, alright. Thanks for telling me, alright? I don't know any of those names about hospitals and medicines and anything, okay? Alright, so sis right here is preparing the moringa leaves that we will be using for our mungus. Oops! <laughs> Scarlett's doing her assignment because she doesn't have class for how many days, Panga? You don't know? Say hi to the guys! Um, Okay, so for our lunch today, guys, we are going to be having mongos. So we've already um, cooked the mongos for a bit. And then we're going to put moringa leaves, um, squash, some garlic, onion, and all that. I'm going to be cooking that in a few. Um, we are actually continuing to do the papa's extension in the front of his bedroom. So they're currently working on it now, but it's so hard to go there. Um, probably later in the afternoon, I'm gonna give you guys an update. Look, it's windy, but it's also very hot. Okay, this is the current update. Papa is feeling good, looking better. Tomorrow, we're gonna go to the city to do his blood test.
Hello everybody, good afternoon. Time check right now. It is currently 5 p.m. and they just finished for today. So I'm gonna give you guys an update. I'm so sorry I was not really like filming all throughout when they were like working on here because the sun oh my gosh it's very harsh and I just could not stay outside but yeah anyway here it is I'm gonna take you guys here what is the current progress in Papa's balcony <laughs> we're gonna call it all right so first things first um, we're gonna start right here guys on the side all right so this is how it looks here on the side area we've actually have like about two piles of hollow block underneath the ground so this is how the piling looks like on this area so it's basically done i would say they're gonna stop right here and then on this side it's the same thing we have two piles of hollow block in the bottom of the ground as well and then it's gonna stop right here and then on the other side here is how it looks all right there we go so as you guys can see we are using this iron um circle thing <laughs> here i am again so bad at all of these names that i don't know about construction and whatnot but i'm trying my best okay so yeah um this is how it looks again this is going to be 10 by 10 feet and i know a lot of you guys will ask me like mj why did you not just extend that area where my sis front living area as well um and that's because it was not really in my plan to basically do this you know um as you guys know we didn't know what happened to papa and all that so <laughs> this was not in my plan originally but um obviously papa badly need this one and i know that some of you guys have actually asked like where's mom why can we not see her in the videos why was she not in the hospital taking care of papa we have a different dynamic in our family and um, papa can't really stay that long in my house um, because of this um, i think if you are an og here in the vlog you guys know the reason behind it papa and mom are separated for some of you guys that do not know and they're just very civil to each other um, they don't really talk and all that so yeah you guys can see that mom is not gonna be in the vlog in the next you know couple of weeks while papa is staying with me um because that's just how it is all right so anyway this is how the progress is looking um if you guys can see over there i'm gonna try to zoom it in in that area this is where they're gonna put oh my gosh it's not working okay this is where they're gonna put another square tube which is like that so square tube here and here and then on the other side as well so that um that's where they can attach it and then they can put the roof so if you guys can see here they've already this is how they did it that's pretty crazy so look they just put it in the middle and it's pretty locked so that's pretty cool all right so that's how it looks guys this is i would say two days of work good morning my sis just woke up <laughs> it's 5 p.m everyone was actually sleeping earlier um but yeah so this is about two days of work or three days i think two days yeah um that they've finished okay so um, I think you guys can remember that here in the bottom area it was actually a bit down so what they did is when they were digging the side to do the hollow block or to do the wall the sand I mean the soil that they got from here they have to put it right here so that everything will be level all right so yeah this is how it's looking so far guys i mean we are i we actually do have three people that's currently working here um in this little project that i do have so we have my uncle and then we have atan as well and then we have my mom's partner so the other guy that you guys can see that's working here that's mom's partner so yeah he is also helping um their friends with papa so yeah <laughs> please understand the dynamic of it huh no more water oh my gosh okay so this is another problem that we do have here in the countryside we don't have water like oh my gosh i can see even literally right now like people bringing 
all their gallons, their barrels, and all that in order to purchase water. So crazy. So yeah, um, this is the current update. There you go. All right guys, so now I'm gonna talk to you about the prices for all of the materials that I got for this balcony that we are making, building for Papa. I'm gonna start right here where I'm currently sitting. We have here the sand. Obviously, these are not all the sand because they've already used some of it. So for the sand, this is one mini dump truck. So that's actually 3,000 pesos. Now, we're gonna move on right here. You guys can see we have here the rebar so the size of the rebar that we decided to get is actually 10 so for that let me just check so that's 10 mm guys uh, we got 15 pieces so that's actually 2250 pesos now we have here the roof and the roof size is 22 by 8 feet and we got 14 pieces so that's 2920 pesos and then we have here the hollow block so for the hollow block we got 100 pieces guys and hollow block costs 15 pesos each so that is 1500 pesos and then what do we have here okay so we have here the cement so for the cement we got 10 sacks of cement 180 pesos each so that is 1,800 pesos. Now, for the, the tubo or this one, this is we, what we use for the um, column. So that one is actually number three. So that is 1,500 pesos. Oh my gosh. <laughs> So guys, this one is 1,500 pesos, but because the length of this is 20 feet, so we actually cut it in half. So the other one is going to be over there. So that's okay. I think that is actually the most expensive one. And then we also have two smaller um, iron thing. Where is it? I don't know where is it. Ah, it's over there. So we have here the two smaller ones so we got this if you guys can see this is number two that's the size of number two so for that that's actually costing 720 pesos since we got two that's 1440 pesos and then we have the square tube two by four um 1400 pesos because we got two then we have another square tube which is two by two we have four pieces so that's 1760 pesos and what else and then we have the welding rod because obviously we're using the welding machine in order to put things together so the welding rod is 150 pesos so yeah those are pretty much everything so I don't know what is the total, but I actually gave mom about 18,000 pesos and I still needed to give her 1,000 pesos. So I feel like everything was around 19,000 pesos, guys. So this is going to be it um, because we've like measured everything and my uncle said um, it should be sufficient to make the entire thing so hopefully <laughs> that will happen and that we don't need to add more materials so yeah um, again the um, how it would look is pretty much going to be the same as how it is in mine and the back of the house so we will have some railings right here and then we're gonna have some grills as well 
So yeah, this is how it looks so far. Today is Tuesday, right? Tuesday, so we still have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So we still have four days. Maybe they can finish this around like Friday. I mean, it should. They just need to do, you know, the sand and everything. The only problem we're having is actually it's very hot, guys. Like I feel so bad for them when they're working here. Oh my gosh, when it's only 7 a.m., it's like scorching like hot like it's very very hot but yeah that's why we have like umbrellas if you guys can see and mommy's umbrella the biggest umbrella as well is here um so that at least it can help them get some shade but yeah this is how it looks so far tomorrow papa and i are gonna go to the city because he will have his blood test and then obviously they're gonna continue to work right here so yeah i'm gonna update you guys as well on that